trauma for the rest of her life. How can you say that we do not need feminism when women still do not have equal pay? Hello everyone, welcome back to a brand new video. If you do go on to enjoy today's video and want more content like this, then feel free to leave a like on the video and subscribe to the channel. This is very true. Snowflakes at it again. Where like I say, oh, you're bald Joe Biden. No one says anything. When I'm shitting on the straight white dudes, you guys are literally turning me into a reactionary. When I shit on the straight white dudes in, a exact, in the exact same fashion, no one bats an eye. But as soon as I say Amy Klobuchar is a sociopath, because literally her staff, her staff members have said she's a sociopath. Everyone's like, I can't believe you guys are attacking a woman. Shut the fuck up, dude. Yeah, I hate women. How about that? They like taking away other people's free speech. Why are you turning down people's signs? Are you not? No, you're violating his First Amendment rights. You have every right to believe whatever you want, but why are you turning down his signs? What gives you a right to put you over him? Why are you turning down his signs? Why are you turning down his sign? Ma'am, why are you? A man can breathe and it would offend a feminist. Words of the Oxford Dictionary when a man explains something, usually in a condescending or patronizing manner, a bit like what I'm doing now, but to a woman. The union behind the phone line says mansplaining is a growing problem in the modern workplace. Yeah, it does smell an awful lot like that. Gender equality for all genders, except for men. Women have the right to be anything they want, except a stay at home mom. It's my body, so it's my choice, unless you need to wear a mask. We have the right to freedom of speech, unless you're a conservative. The father has no say, unless it's to provide financial support. <laughs> smell that? I smell. This was really funny. I gotta show you this picture. It's a shocking, devastating picture. It's a father and his nearly two-year-old daughter. They drowned at the U.S.-Mexico border. As you will see, what she says is inaccurate. Milo Yiannopoulos, I hope he hears it. Woo! Hey, yeah! Yeah! Woo! Dear Milo, how can you say that rape culture is not real when I hear the screams of my brothers and sisters piercing my ears each night? Their truths buried by a system which does not care about them. When 20% of women will be raped while in college, and 9 out of 10 of them will know... If a man helps you, it's mansplaining, according to her. And then their legs being apart, it's, it's their kind of like can-do sensibility encroaching into women's areas. And this does happen. I mean, mostly it happens to me when I'm driving, when men who I don't even know stop and say, help me how, to get into a corner or to park my car. Or indeed, when I'm driving somewhere I know very well, my husband decides to tell me where to go. It's funny how the left hate offensive speech, but are happy to use it against their opposition. Shut the hell up. Go kill yourself. Go sit in the middle of Where can one find this button? How can you say that we do not need feminism when women still do not have equal pay for equal work? The wage gap is simply the average earnings of men and women working full time. It does not count for different job positions, hours worked, or different jobs. It has nothing to do with the same job. It has nothing to do with discrimination. I think she just learned what free speech is. Okay, but why are you turning on his sign? He has every right to have it up. You're you have right. every right to have your opinion, but why yeah, are you turning on his sign? You have right to put your wrong signs up there. You, you don't see if you, with the nose down, do you? You can put up your own signs, but why are you All turning right, on his yeah, signs? Alright, you're right, you're right. I'm you're right. I'm sorry, you're right. Why on earth would she do that? The governor was Republican, and three of our four constitutional officers were Republican. And then I started running. And every single time I have run, I have won every single congressional district in my state, including Michelle Bachman's. Okay? That's when you guys are supposed to cheer, okay? Face the music, feminists. All right, today we're going to talk about modern day feminism. I'm sick and tired of hearing females deeming men inferior to us. They're not, honestly. Half the stuff that we would like to do, we will never be able to do. 
no matter how much you want to praise that we are capable of doing everything from now in biology. A helpline for mansplaining victims? You must be kidding. Mind in the in the workplace, in the office, and I think if there's a helpline to, to allow them to vent a bit of steam or, or just to find out that there are other women who also feel anxious because their words aren't being taken as 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 as, as authority, um, that they always need to defer to someone else. I think it's quite fun. Why do they hate straight men so much? Many lists coming out lately, like, you know, the top 10 feminist dudes you want to follow on Twitter, or like, five feminist dudes doing great work, which is cool, but then it turns out they're all cisgender. Like, I have actually seen so-called feminist guys get women to... I swear those are a feminist's favorite words, because they seem to use it all the time. Which is something apparently we need to do in the United States of America, in our nation's capital. <laughs> the police are a part of a racist, heteropatriarchal, heterosexist system. <laughs> Damn, is she coming for all the feminists? Another woman say that men aren't crap. Get out of here with that statement. Um, you're just putting down a whole a whole group of people. How would you like it if they did that to you guys? You wouldn't. Also, the standards that we hold for men when it comes down to dating, let's be honest with, with this. As a female, you wouldn't even be able to achieve those standards that you're holding. Back again with their crazy protests. Well, this was really weird. And what do you think about how she um, competed in the debate? That was amazing. It was just so lopsided for her. I was, I was almost embarrassed for Donald Trump and, 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 my, and my friend Alex Jones. Seriously? Hey, Alex Jones. Hey, uh, remember me, uh, double uh, Grey Goose and uh, soda, about a thousand of them all the time? They're actually my neighbor in Westlake. Yeah, I know him actually pretty well. He's an alcoholic. In Everything she has said is spot on. Let's knock this modern day feminism out of the, just out. Because it is toxic for today's society, especially for Thank you for watching this video. If you enjoyed the video, then feel free to leave a like and subscribe to the channel for more content like this and much more. Goodbye for now, and we'll see you next time.